Hello Every Nation Youth, this is Des coming to you with the devotion. So today we're going to be looking at humility and the Christ example in humility. And we're just going to start off by reading a scripture from Philippians 2 from verse 1 um, to verse 11. This is Paul writing and he says, So if there's any encouragement in Christ, any comfort from love, any participation in the spirit, any affection and sympathy, complete my joy by being of the same mind, same love, being in full accord of and of one mind. Do nothing from selfish ambition or conceit, but in humility count others more significant than yourselves. Let each of you look not only to his own interest, but also in the interests of others. Have this mind among yourselves, which is yours in Christ Jesus, who, though he was in the form of God, did not count equality with God a thing to be grasped, but emptied himself by taking the form of a servant, being born in the likeness of man and being found in human form. He humbled himself by becoming obedient to the point of death and even death on a cross. Therefore, God has highly exalted him and bestowed on him the same, the name that is above every other name, that so at that name of Jesus every knee shall bow in heaven and on earth and under the earth, and every tongue confess that Jesus Christ is Lord, to the glory of God the Father. This is just such an amazing scripture that Paul here is saying, you know, if there's anything, you know, that would that would bring him joy. And obviously, you know, this would bring Jesus and the Father so much joy, is that we are humble like Jesus was humble. And I think this is an important aspect to think about Jesus when we think about humility, when we think about what humility is. Jesus being a King of Kings, and the Lord of Lords came down to be not just a human, but to suffer as a human, to suffer the worst. He had to humble himself and he had to submit himself um, to this mission. So with this, I want to exhort us to humble ourselves, to put other people above ourselves and think of the humility that Christ had when he actually died for us. Can we be those people who are humble enough to help people up and to, and to, and to help people to be like Christ as well? Um, if it's your friend that needs to be like this, I pray that you'd be one who reminds him of this is who Jesus is to us and this is how we can humble ourselves. Um, so with this, I just pray that we would be ones who are truly Christ's example. We would be ones who are truly thinking like Jesus and not just times when it's more convenient or times where it makes more sense to think like him. No, it always makes sense. When you're devoted to Jesus, it is your whole life. So with this, I exalt us to, to be people who live in humility and represent Christ fully. Amen.